Have you ever looked around and wondered if this is all there is? Have you ever felt a strange sense of deja vu, as if you've experienced a moment before? Or perhaps you've questioned the nature of your existence, pondering if there's more to life than what meets the eye. What if our reality isn't real? What if everything we see, touch and feel is just an elaborate illusion? What if it's all a sophisticated computer program? Imagine for a moment that our entire universe is nothing more than a highly advanced simulation created by beings far more technologically advanced than we can comprehend. It sounds like science fiction, but it's a question that has captivated philosophers and scientists for centuries. From ancient philosophical musings to modern scientific inquiries, the idea that our reality might be an artificial construct has persisted through the ages. The idea is called the simulation hypothesis, and it suggests we might be living inside a giant complex computer simulation. This hypothesis has gained traction in recent years, especially with the rapid advancements in technology and artificial intelligence. Sound crazy? Stick with me. While it may seem far-fetched, there are compelling arguments and intriguing evidence that make this hypothesis worth considering. Let's unpack this mind-bending concept and explore why some of the brightest minds entertain its possibility. We'll delve into the philosophical arguments, the scientific theories, and the technological advancements that lend credence to the simulation hypothesis. We'll dive into the science, the arguments, and the evidence, or lack thereof, that suggests we might be plugged into a cosmic computer game. From the nature of consciousness to the limits of our understanding of the universe, we'll examine the various facets of this fascinating idea. So buckle up and prepare to question the very fabric of your reality. Imagine a future civilization, far more advanced than our own. They've mastered computing power beyond our wildest dreams. Their technology allows them to create incredibly detailed simulations of universes, complete with stars, planets, and even life. These simulations are so sophisticated that the simulated beings within them are self-aware. They experience their world as completely real, unaware that they exist within a program. This, in essence, is the simulation hypothesis. One of the most compelling arguments for the simulation hypothesis is a simple matter of probability. If we accept that creating such advanced simulations is even theoretically possible, then the chances of us being in a real universe versus a simulated one become a numbers game. Think about it. If a civilization could create millions, billions, or even trillions of simulations, then the number of simulated universes would vastly outnumber the one real universe. Suddenly, the odds of us being in the original become incredibly slim. The simulation hypothesis isn't just the stuff of late-night dorm room debates. It's a concept that has caught the attention of serious thinkers, including some of the world's leading scientists and entrepreneurs. Elon Musk, the visionary behind SpaceX and Tesla, has famously argued that the odds of us living in a simulation are billions to one. Oxford philosopher Nick Bostrom has written extensively on the simulation argument, laying out a compelling case for why we should take the possibility seriously. Section 5, Glitch in the Matrix When Reality Seems Off Have you ever experienced a strange coincidence that made you question the nature of reality? Perhaps you've encountered a situation where events aligned so perfectly that it felt like more than just chance. These moments can be unsettling, making us wonder if there's a hidden pattern or force at play. A dream that felt eerily real? Dreams can sometimes blur the lines between reality and imagination, leaving us with lingering emotions and vivid memories. It's as if our minds are trying to tell us something, or perhaps tapping into a different layer of existence, or a moment where time seemed to slow down or speed up. These experiences can be disorienting, making us question our perception of time. Whether it's a life-changing event or a mundane moment, the distortion of time can make us feel like we're in a different dimension. Proponents of the simulation hypothesis point to these glitches in the matrix as potential evidence that our reality isn't quite what it seems. They argue that these anomalies could be signs that we are living in a sophisticated simulation created by an advanced civilization. While these experiences can often be explained by psychology or neuroscience, such as the brain's way of processing information or coping with stress, they still leave room for speculation. Our brains are incredibly complex, and sometimes the explanations provided by science don't fully satisfy our curiosity. 
They fuel the imagination and make us wonder if there's something more to the fabric of our existence. Could there be layers of reality that we are not yet able to perceive? These questions push the boundaries of our understanding and inspire us to explore the mysteries of the universe. Whether through science, philosophy, or personal introspection, the quest to understand our reality continues to captivate and challenge us. Section six, the pixelated universe, zooming in on the fabric of reality. Let's dive into the realm of physics for a moment. According to quantum mechanics, the universe isn't smooth and continuous as it appears to our senses. Instead, it's made up of discrete units of energy and matter, much like pixels on a computer screen. This pixelated nature of reality, while incredibly small, suggests that our universe might have a fundamental resolution, a limit to how much detail it can contain, just like a computer simulation. Section 7. Quantum Quirkiness, Where Logic Takes a Vacation Quantum mechanics, the study of the very small, is full of mind-boggling phenomena that defy our everyday intuition. Particles can be in multiple states at once, information seems to travel faster than the speed of light, and the act of observation itself influences the outcome of experiments. These strange behaviors, while well-established through experiments, are difficult to reconcile with our classical understanding of the universe. Could it be that these quantum quirks are simply bugs in the simulation? Section 8. The Case of the Missing Information Black Holes and the Cosmic Hard Drive Black holes, those cosmic monsters that gobble up everything that gets too close, present another intriguing puzzle. According to our current understanding of physics, information that falls into a black hole is lost forever. However, some physicists believe that information must be conserved, even within a black hole. Could it be that this missing information is simply stored elsewhere, perhaps in a cosmic hard drive beyond our reach? Section 9. Consciousness Conundrum are we players or programs? Perhaps the most profound question raised by the simulation hypothesis is that of consciousness. If we are living in a simulation, does that mean our thoughts, feelings, and experiences are also simulated? Are we simply lines of code programmed to believe we are sentient beings? Or is consciousness something more fundamental, something that transcends the boundaries of our simulated reality? This is a question that philosophers and scientists are still grappling with today. Section 10, Life, the Universe, and Everything, the Implications of a Simulated Existence. If it turns out that we are living in a simulation, what does that mean for us? Does it invalidate our experiences or diminish the meaning of our lives? Or does it open up a whole new realm of possibilities? Some argue that living in a simulation would be a comforting thought. It would mean that death might not be the end, that our creators are benevolent overseers and that the universe is even stranger and more wonderful than we ever imagined. Section 11, your move. What if we are living in a simulation? Imagine for a moment that everything you know, every experience you've had and every person you've met is part of an elaborate digital construct. This idea, while seemingly far-fetched, has been the subject of serious philosophical and scientific debate. The simulation hypothesis, while still firmly in the realm of speculation, challenges us to question the nature of our reality and our place within it. It suggests that our universe could be an artificial simulation created by an advanced civilization with computing power far beyond our current capabilities. It's a thought experiment that forces us to confront our assumptions about the universe and the limits of our own knowledge. If we are indeed living in a simulation, what does that mean for our understanding of existence, consciousness, and the laws of physics? So, the next time you look up at the night sky or marvel at the complexity of the natural world, Take a moment to consider the possibility that you might be witnessing a simulation of epic proportions. The stars, the planets, and even the intricate details of life on Earth could all be part of a grand design, meticulously programmed to create the illusion of reality. What if this is all a game? If our lives are part of a simulation, it raises profound questions about free will, destiny, and the nature of reality itself. Are we merely characters in a cosmic game, Following a script written by an unknown creator, how would you play it? Would you make different choices, knowing that your actions might be part of a predetermined sequence? Or would you strive to break free from the constraints of the simulation, seeking to understand the true nature of your existence? 
The answers to these questions remain elusive, but the journey to explore them is a fascinating adventure in itself.